So for anyone that's played around with it for a little while will understand it's hard to get some perspective on how you're doing on a daily basis. It can seem really slow, even though that, you know, you get really good interest every single day. Uh, not every day you have a zero day. Some days you have like a zip, like the other day we had a 0.3%. If you really want to get into the system, you really need to understand the power of compound interest. And that is what we're going to discover today. And what we're going to do now is by joining our network, we want to give away probably the most powerful tool that doesn't exist yet in the BitConnect system. And it kind of does exist, but not to an extent of how it would be really, really useful for everyone. So let me give you an example. If we go to Let's say for let's go to the daily volatility chart. So if we look at the volatility, you can see here you got 1.85% pending. That's tomorrow, that's a good day. Today, 0.13%. Uh, not too good. The day before was pretty good. 1.85%, 1%, 1.5%. That's good, but what we need to do is to work out an average over time and figure out how that will affect our daily reinvests. So there is one inbuilt, but it's quite a remedial projected earnings calculator, and it doesn't really show you the compounding power. So if we look at the last seven days, for instance, we have a daily interest average of 1.15%, which is fantastic. So let's say, for instance, we started, this is day one, 101, on the BitConnect network, and we invest, let's say we just invest $100, the minimum, and we invest that based on this rate of interest over a longer period of time, let's say we do that for 365 days. And let's do the calculator. Let's click it. So your profit on your $100 principal would be $419. So your return on investment would be 419.75%. So your profit with your principal back, which you will get within those days, because it's 299, is $519.75. So for a $100 investment, based on the history of the last week, in a year's time, you will have made with principal $519. That's a 519% return on investment. So you can't get that at a bank. But let's look a little further, or let's look about how you want to cash out, cash in, add some more, take some out. These are all things that you would probably want to do during that period of time over the next year. There's no point putting in $100 and then having it locked up for a year and then forgetting about it. It takes time, it takes effort, it takes, you know, time is money. So what we've come up with, and I've seen some remedial versions of this on different YouTube channels, but we've really given some time into trying to make something that's a little bit better. So here we introduce our, our BitConnect calculator. So. What we're doing here, if we look at the history over the last, well, since its inception, since the inception of BitConnect, it's averaged over 1.9% daily compound interest. So you can see what we've done here. We've got a starting amount and a base rate. So in here, we've actually put the base rate of 0.9%. So that will give us something tangible to think about in the future. And we can actually add dates to the system. So we've given it a principle of the very, very minimum you can put in as a single transaction to get into the system is $100. You can put in $1,000, you can put in $5,000, you can put in $10,000. But let's start on the small scale. So what we've got here, we've got the date system here. We've got the number of days that you've been in the system. We have your principle, which is mirrored above, which is your $100. We've also added a true rate because when you invest into the system, there's a different structure because you get different, there's an incentive program that goes from 0.25%, 0.2, 0.1, depending on the amount that you put in. So we've also given a calculator on the daily interest in this column. The balance of your lending wallet anticipated based on this uh, base rate here. Your investment amount, which is your daily reinvest, your deposit or withdrawal amount here, and if you put in no interest or no daily reinvest at all, just leaving it in the system, this is the figure that you can take out each year. So by putting in $100 and doing zero, zero reinvest every day, based on this figure of 0.9%, you will take out $328.50 a year, roughly. 
give or take. So how does this BitConnect system work on the calculator that we've made? So what we need to do is to come up with a figure of being able to move and change and augment the system as we need. So let's say for instance today, now this is one month from now, so today's day as of recording is the 28th of the 9th of September. So to draw that figure down, all we do is go on the corner box and double click and it puts those figures all the way down and that will go into infinity, all the way down. There we are, day 90. So with $100 of daily reinvesting your 0.9%, your true rate is also 0.9% because it's below the $1,010 jump where it goes where you get the additional bonus 0.1%. So your daily interest, this is an aggregate based on the true rate and your daily interest. So at day 90, on day 3, you've actually made $210. So you're actually $110 above the $100 that you've already put in. So where do we get $200 from? $200 days, day 82. So in 82 days of just reinvesting the interest that you get through the BitConnect system, you double your money. You actually get your principal 100% return on investment. Now at this, at this point, you haven't actually received your principal because you've put in $100. So you have to wait till day 299 in order to get your principal back as well. So you've got your $200 there, but we have to go to day 299. And then on this day, 299, you've actually turned that $100 into $1,370 plus your principal. This figure doesn't even, doesn't even calculate your principal back. So on this day, this calculator doesn't say you actually get your $100 back. So your true rate is still 0.9%. And your daily interest at this point in one year's time, or in 299 days time, you are earning $12.33 every single day, based on this 0.9% base rate. Now the rate can go up, the rate can go down, but we know the average over the last year has been above 0.9, so I'm erring on the side of caution. If, however, you don't do any reinvests after that day and you get your interest back, you will actually be earning $4,500 per year. Now, if we scroll back up, you can see here the investment around, amount here in pink. So you can see these are all $10 reinvests. So if we go in and we put in just $100, on day 12, we can put in $10 worth of interest. Now, this is $10 that will be sat inside your BitConnect lending wallets here. So when that figure goes from, say in my instance, $9.20, now I've already done a $60 reinvest today based on just pure interest alone. This is the figure that's left. So when this figure goes to $10, I can then go to reinvest. And I can then click all of these figures here and it will add up to above $10. Mine's still at $9.20, so I can't do one at the moment. So when you get back to this system here, you can see, oh, wrong one. You can see that on day 12, we get to reinvest $10, which is 10% of our starting amounts. And then on day 22, we can also add another $10, another reinvest, just pure interest, adding it back into the system, letting it compound for you. So this actually shows you your $10 invest amount and the balance of your wallet. So. $10.70 minus $10 that you're reinvesting is 70 cents. The daily interest the following day of $1.08 gives you a balance of 178. And here, this calculates what should be in your lending wallet. So this gives you, this gives you something in the future where you can actually predict when you can do a reinvest. Now then, let's say for instance, you change this figure to a thousand dollars everything changes so now you've got your reinvest on day two ten dollars lending wallet 18 so out of your 18 dollars you take ten dollars you're left with eight you get 909 following day you've got 1709 you have enough money to reinvest ten dollars again 
You invest $10 on day three, you're left with 918. It's going up slowly. 1627 in your lending wallet. You can then invest another 10 and so on and so forth. And then it accumulates, it accumulates and goes up. This then tells you that on day 26, you can then invest $20 because your balance has gone above $20 here, $21 and so on and so forth. So this is really good for playing around with withdrawing and depositing more money and withdrawing money. So you can actually cash in and cash out during the system without messing up your calculator. So it's all well and good looking at something like this. Let's get rid of this and let's actually look at my personal one. This is just a template. So let's go to my active BitConnect calculator. So you can see that I started one month ago as from the day of recording. Today is the 28th of September. Day one, I invested half a Bitcoin. And my half a Bitcoin bought me at the time on the 28th of August, $2,250 worth of investment, which I brought in and converted to BitConnect coins and then subsequently lent the whole thing. Now, on the same day, I actually thought I'd dip my toe in. I actually started with the dregs. I gave them the dregs of the 0.5. It was like 0.51 something Bitcoin. I brought in the dregs, which was actually converted to $120. So my actual investment on day one was $2,250 plus $120. So my actual day one investment, although it says 2250 here, was actually 2370. So my initial opening deposit on day one was $2,370. So this calculator lets me look into the future. So today, as of recording, you can see this orange bar here is actually day, we're now on day 31, 32. Okay, we're on day 32, 28th of September. It's now early morning. So I can color that one in. And you can do the same with your version of your one. So the principal on day 32 from my $2,370, my principal now just lending the interest that I get every single day is $3,200. So my daily interest is now over $30 a day. So my lending wallet today should be 36 and my investment amount is a whole round number of uh, a multiple of 10, which should be 30. And now this calculator actually calculates how much you should invest. So it tells you. It also tells you that if you stop doing this daily reinvest, so if you don't put in this 30 here and just take out the interest, that interest alone, if you never, ever, ever put in another penny after one month, you'll be earning $11,333 based on this 0.9%, fairly simple. Let's look into the future. So as you can see, there's no other deposits or withdrawals here. But what I do want to do is show you this little ticker here. So if you look down, if I click in daily reinvest, it will tell me the figure here that I need to reinvest every single day as a whole figure, as a whole factor of 10. So I can scroll down, I can see into the future, see everything goes 40, 30, 40, 40, it's starting to go up. And then on day 62, I can invest 50 every single day. And then the 50s become more and more and there's some 60s appearing. As we get into day 100, they're all 60s. And then there's the odd 70 as we get into day 114. Again, day 114, that's only four months away. If I'd stop there, I'm taking $23,500 a year as a passive income from doing nothing other than logging in and clicking a button. It's that simple. So how does this work as we go along? We go into Christmas time, December 25th. I'm investing $70 a day. Now the thing is, is that this calculator assumes that you are putting in your daily reinvest every single day because the most powerful thing in this system is that you use the power of compound interest. Go onto Google, look it up, look up compound interest and then look at uh, some of the quotes around the people that tried to get their head around it many, many, many years ago. Some of the great philosophers of our time have 
amaze themselves at the power of compounding when you compound every single day. So we carry on. We look a little bit into the future. January the 1st, New Year. Investment amount goes up and up and up. The daily rate goes up and up and up. 120. So if you look here, this assumes that we're just using with um, multiples of 10. So if you do this thing called interval reinvest, this button here, it clears this system because here it's telling me that I should be investing 1,010 because the program has worked out that it's actually more beneficial to wait and hoard for that particular amount of time. So that's 15 days to wait that amount of time, reinvest, let it, let it accumulate in the BitConnect wallet and then reinvest the 1,010. So the calculator actually tells you when to stop doing your daily reinvests. So here, when we get to the $6,000 mark, so day 98, 99, it tells me now to stop doing my 50 and $60 a day reinvests and let that accumulate. Once you let it accumulate, you can then do the 1,010, which bumps you up to the next level. You then automatically, on that figure, every single day, get an extra 0.1%. So this figure here, your true rate actually goes up. It goes up because it then calculates the base rate plus the extra incentive that you get to save. So if you carry on every single day, look at the dis distance here. So the first one is 18 days. The second one, third one, 15 days. The reinvests get closer and closer. So it gives you a plan to know what to do in the future. Now, what I've done here, on March the 4th, now this isn't going to be exact because we don't get exactly 0 0.9 every single day. And I'll show you that as the, I've actually down here, I've got projected and I've got an actual and I've got the graph which compares the actual to the project, projected so you can see how you're performing over time. So here, what I'm trying to do is that my first investment of $2,250, I don't get back for another 239 days. So to mitigate the fact that I've got that collateral tied up for that time, I want to start drawing a little bit out. Now, this is my personal plan. I will give you this if you want. Uh, if you sign up to the network, you will receive this uh, calculator with all of these figures in. Uh, I'll change the dates for you. But here I've actually done a withdrawal. And I want to withdraw this into Bitcoin so I can send this to my Bitcoin my my exchange Bitcoin wallet so I can actually cash this out put this in my bank so part of my plan would be around March the 4th day 189 bearing in mind I put in 2250 on day one on day 189 I plan to withdraw $500 all things being equal and then in the same month I'm taking out another $500 so in the month of March 2018, I'm going to take out $1,000. I'm cashing out $500, or $1,000 in this case in, the, in, in March, on day 200. Let's carry on. So if I don't do these reinvests every day, by day 200, I'm at $137 a day passive income. I cannot do this reinvest anymore, not put this in, and I'm still getting a $50,000 a year passive income but we use the power of the system just to skim the top. This is an insurance policy, an insurance for whatever reason, but this is a planned insurance policy. We go to April, there's a $500 there. Withdrawal, $500 there. I've withdrawn $1,000. Passive income in April. I'm still doing my daily in reinvests, but here, $61,214. I'm only on day 227. I'm not even a year in yet. Let's carry on. Let's look down. Let's see how this BitConnect projection works. So you can see now how close together these $1,010 reinvests go. It started off at 18 days. We're now at one, two, three, four, every five days, every five days. Then on day 252, I plan to take out $500. And in the same month of May, another thousand dollars. June, a thousand dollars. And then we go to July. I've taken out a thousand and a thousand. In July, I can take out two thousand dollars, but I'm still doing my daily reinvests. 
every five to six days. Then after that, July, every other day or thereabouts. August, a thousand dollars, a thousand dollars. If I stop, I'm still not even at one year. A thousand dollars every other day. I've started with 2,250. In less than a year, I'm reinvesting over a thousand dollars every other day. And then we get to year one. So my year one, based on that 0.9%, based on my starting amount, is $531 a day. If I stop reinvesting these thousand dollars a day, I get those extra thousand dollars, plus I get nearly 200,000 pounds a year. Dollars a year. I'm converting because I'm British, I'm converting into pounds. £150,000 or $193,000. But it gets really interesting after the first year because look, I'm reinvesting nearly every other day. 1,010, 1,010. In September, this time next year, $1,000, $2,000. In October, in month 13, $1,000, $2,000. I'm now investing every single day $1,000, $1,000 because my daily interest is approaching nearly $1,000 a day. The lending wallet, you can see, you can see the figures. I'm taking out $1,000, but this is still the balance every day. So when you get to here, November the 2nd, 2018, I've taken out $1,000 again in November, and another 1,000, and then 3,000 in November. I'm taking out even more, but now I can still put in $1,000 every day, getting that extra 0.1%. Now, the power of the interval reinvest shows you when to stop doing the $1,000 a day reinvest and when to save up and do $5,010 reinvest because you get 0.02% uh, every single day. Now, we're getting into crazy figures now because look at the yearly, $437,000 a year as a passive income just over a year's time. But if you're greedy and you want to speculate, you can still, t I'm still taking an income. In December, month 14, 15, month 15, $4,000 in December. It's Christmas time. You're going to go shopping. December the 11th, another $4,000. I've taken out $8,000 in December. But I'm doing my 5,010 reinvests. Every time it accumulates, I've still taken out 4,000, 5,000. Put in another 5,000. We're at half a million dollars a year. Again, if you don't do this, you don't need to do this, you don't need to do this. If this is your risk limit, stop. Take it out every day. Cash out. Take your half a million dollars. All you've put in, all I've put in is $2,250. But we carry on. Go down the line. See how the calculator works. In January, taking out $5,000. $10,000. In February, I've taken out $10,000. In March, next year, 2019, $15,000. And I'm still doing my $5,000 reinvest and they're getting closer and closer together until they get every single day nearly. They would be nearly every single day if I wasn't in April taking out five, ten, fifteen thousand, twenty thousand dollars $15,000, $20,000 I'm taking out as a passive income. By April 2019, 1.4 million pounds uh, dollars a year I'd be taking out if I stopped doing the reinvests every day because the daily interest here is $3,843 every day. But we compound further, we carry on, we use the system as it was designed to be. Keep putting in your, your reinvests every single day. Look, every single day here. Because it's approaching the $5,000 a day mark, you can put in nearly $5,000 a day. So we get to our first $10,000 reinvest. 0.25% every single day. Every time you do this reinvest, you get 0.25 on top of your true rate, on top of your base rate, 0.25%. So that makes your cumulative true rate 1.08%. You're uh, averaging over 1% per day every time you do a reinvest. And this figure here, and these figures here, bearing in mind we're on, we're on day 627, we're, we're only in the second year. And we haven't even calculated our principal return 
that we've had previously. We haven't even reinvested the principal, so we've had all of our principal back. And our principal here, if you add it all up and put it all back in, is over half a million dollars. We're not even at the end of year two yet. And look here, two million dollars a year if we stop doing this figure here, plus this figure. This figure here, the two thousand dollars, isn't even including the ten thousand dollar reinvest that you're doing every day. If you stop this, you'd have that plus that. This is the craziness of daily compound interest. It's a snowball. It carries on growing. It carries on growing and growing and growing. Look here, June, June the 4th, 2019, $10,000. June the 10th, $10,000 plus five. Oh, I haven't been greedy this month. There's a reason. $25,000 I've taken in June in 2019. I have a yearly income of 2.6 million. Now this is all hypothetical, but the way the system works, this is exactly how it works, based on this average base rate, based on this figure. It's not a huge amount. It's a huge amount for some people. It's a very, very minor amount for others. But, you know, you can stick your own figure in here. Play with the numbers. See what the calculator tells you. It doesn't lie. It works on averages. So here we get into nearly 10,000 every day. And this is where the fun starts. 683. On July the 11th, this calculator is telling me that on July the 11th, 2019, my principal will be 881,000. I will be averaging a daily investment amount of over $10,000. I'm getting an extra 0.25% on my average base rate of 0.9. And here we stop being greedy because we start to do our own compounding as we take our money out every single day. It starts off low because we haven't quite hit the $10,000 a day mark, we can start here because our lending wallet is over $14,000. So we do our daily reinvest and we just, not greedy, take it $100, but add $100 every single day. Look how it adds up. This is the power of compound interest every single day. Look at the lending wallet. Even though you've taken out three and a half grand, on the 14th of August, the balance is still 11,000. Now you want to keep a big balance in here because some days you may not get your 0.9%. You may get 0.3. So you need enough in that wallet to calculate, to get the 10,000 pound reinvest every single day. So that's what this calculator does. Three, six, three, seven, four. And then this is year two. Day 730, that is your th the end of your second years in the BitConnect system. All I've put in is just over $2,000. It would earn me a yearly interest if I stopped at year two, five and a half million dollars. But why would you do that? Use the power of the system to give you a passive income. Four, eight, four, nine, five thousand dollars every single day. Now, there's no point putting in more than 10,010 because you don't get any more money. You don't get a percentage higher than anything over 10,010. So why would you put any more? You would get the same amount if you put more in. But why don't you start withdrawing? This is the time where you would want to start designing your exit plan. You want to keep the, the minimum amount on the maximum investment amount that you get the most percentage of. So this is capitalism as it should be. So. Your daily interest rates are over 15,000 a day at year two, but you can carry on, carry on. Look what the calculator shows you. It goes crazy, absolutely crazy. Until you're earning 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, $20,000 a day after the second year. And it goes on and it compounds and it grows and it snowballs and it gets crazy and silly. How many of you would let it get to this kind of level? Do you have the balls to be able to do it? Or would you get scared early on? Where is your cutoff point? I'll be really interested to find out. Why don't you put some of those in the comments below and let me know where you would start to get really itchy feet and think, oh, this is starting to get serious money now. Because here, your passive income for not reinvesting would be over $15 million. And we're not even in year three yet. We're still not in year three. So this is all of the future. This is all potentially possible. But until it's in your pocket, it's not money, is it? So let's form a plan. So based on these figures here, I've created a mirror 
of everything I've done. So I can play around with these figures here. If I put in, I want to take out $50 this day, I can. And the calculator will make allowances for me. So if I want to put out $100 here, it can. And the calculator will work everything out. So this is a really funky little calculator that we've come up with. So everything there minus all of these edits. So this, this really here, this bit connect area is to play around with taking money in, taking money out, and to give you an idea far into the future of what happens. Now, if you don't actually do, if you, if you stick to the system, if you stick to the best method of compounding daily to get the best amounts of collateral at the end, plus your uh, principal, then what you should do is not take these figures out. You, sh you should actually just delete these. But then what you should do is mirror that into your projected because you can actually draw graphs off of your projected against your actual. So this is a, a copy with, without the withdrawals. This is used against the graph to actually figure out how your daily reinvests are actually performing. And this is my real reinvest. These are my actuals. So I started off with 2,250 and you can see here the daily base rates. These are the only things I have to change every single day based on the figures that I have here. So if I go now to the volatility page, you can see that we've got a 1%, a 1.85%, a 0.13% and a 1.85% for tomorrow. So if you now look on the calculator in real time, if I scroll to the bottom to today's day, as of recording, I've got my 1.5, 1%, 1%, 1 1.85 and my zero. 0.13. So what I need to add is my 1.85 for tomorrow because I it needs to know what I'm getting tomorrow so I can plan for it. So it's 1.85. So we need to create a new block. Use our trusty key to bring it down. It will automatically populate the dates. And it's 1.85, was it? 1.85. There's uh, every other day, 1.85. So we click on the one point. 85 uh, we, we click on the base rate key we stick in the 1.85 and it will calculate that tomorrow I get to put in $60 on day 33 as a reinvest it will tell me that my daily payment is 62.85 uh, 62.38 and it says that my lending wallet after putting in um, after the daily payment my wallet balance based on the 333 I had on the day before will be 65.76 and my reinvest amount is 60. So it tells me what my reinvest was the day before. And my actuals, my dates and my times are over here. My actual reinvests, the history of everything I've put in just from interest alone in 30 days is there. So how does that work? How do you draw useful information? So what we've got is a graph which plots everything. So this is my real investment plan my real projections based on the 0.9% and the red line is my actual. So I actually had a couple of bad days the day I started off, so I was already on the back foot. So it predicted 2390 when it should have been 2440. But you can see I've actually touched the black line. I'm pretty much in line now. I'm just above predicted. So that 0.9% actually is correct. It has been throughout the whole year. So you can use that 0 0.9. It's a conservative effort because some days it's a much higher and some days is lower and some days is zero. But the average over time is 0.9%. So this is a really, really powerful calculator. And it gets more exciting and a little bit scary when you start to get a year ahead, 18 months ahead into the future. That's year one. So year one on a just over $2,000 reinvest, it's earning you over $500 a day. You could stop there. That could be your, your sweet spot. That could be your, you know what? I can live on that as a passive income on top of my earnings. An extra $500 a day, an extra $197,000 a year. Well, yeah, that would come in really handy. The trick is, is to not get scared. It's to go back in and use the system as it was meant to be used. It's the only way that you get full benefit out of the system. So that there is our calculator. Uh, what else is in the graphs? Oh, it also shows you our reinvest timeline. 
So it shows you the times that you make the reinvest. There's a focus button as well if you want to make it a bit more focused and see what you've done at what times. You can also see your daily reinvest and how they go up and go down. Now this particular high one here was because there was a, there was a zero the day before. Um, and I had one at one in the morning and one at 8 p.m. on the same day. So this, this was actually two days. Um, but it, it averages out. It shows you your graph. It shows you that every day your money is growing. The, you know, that curve is actually going higher and higher and higher. So all of these graphs, all of these tools have been designed so that you can utilize it and use it and give you some forethought, some foresight. It tells you what you should expect tomorrow. It tells you where you should be next week. All things being equal on that 0.9%. So my average my my yearly rate is set at 0.9 which gives me these yearly average figures down here but my actual rate in the last 30 days has been one dollar at 1.03 percent my average payment has been 28 dollars and 66 per day but that's first month it will snowball in the second month it will snowball even more in the third and the fourth so there's always that incentive there there's that incentive to want to carry on and keep doing the reinvest because it's exciting. It's nice to see tangible, real money that you can exchange and put into your bank account whenever you feel like it. Obviously, minus the principal, which is tied up for those 239 days. But as you can see, my starting amount was $2,250. And in one month, I've made $940 worth of profit in 30 days. It's unheard of. You can't get that with the bank. We will go through in other videos how and why that is and how the system works. I mean, in, de in detail and how the system can, sus you know, sustain uh, those kinds of figures. But if you want a copy 